guys, day three of 100 of making comics. This is a bit of a late one for me tonight. Uh, just had Cooper's puppy training tonight, uh, and he graduated. He had his very last class, and he kicked butt. Out of all the other dogs, I think he did the best. I'm probably biased, but I feel that, well, he was the best. Let's just look at it. So, they did this cute little thing where they had his hat, like a graduation hat, and took photos, and it was kind of cool. Um, glad that it's all over now, and now we can sort of get back to training. Now I've got my Wednesday, night, Wednesday nights back, so now I can have an extra night of work. Uh, I thought it was kind of cool to get away. So, I've actually put myself a little list of the things I need to talk about tonight, so I can avoid the whole um thing. Uh, a few people made a few jokes about it to me uh, after I uploaded the video, so. Uh, I watched a few videos just to sort of see how I can avoid it. So I'm going to be working on that tonight. Hopefully we hear a lot less ums and ahs. So, we'll see how we go. Uh, last night I was working on panels and layouts for the next few pages of Legend of Rock. So I'm going to show you a few, uh, a little bit of what I did uh, last night. So uh, I'll be back in one second. Layouts for page four of the Legend of Rock. So here they are. This is uh, pretty much all I managed to get done last night. I uh, had a lot of client work that I needed to do and I still got to get back onto it tonight so I'm going to be pretty tight with actually getting any more rock stuff done as well so I'm just going to try and get at least half an hour out but here's the page 5 yeah page 5 layouts for Legend of Rock uh, issue 1 this is really the first time we actually see the characters close up in the comic so it's a bit of an exciting page and I really wanted to have the characters really stand out uh, trying to get quite a few expressions in there for people to really sort of enjoy. I'm actually really looking forward to this because most of the pages have just been background so far, which one has been great practice because I sucked at backgrounds before, so I feel like I've gotten a lot better there, but it'd just be nice to get back to the characters and really have a lot of fun with them. So this is uh, sort of my setup here, uh, me with my desk and I've also got my script here next to me. Uh, when I'm working on comics I like to have a physical script with me. Uh, it's it's nice to have it on the screen, but just having a physical one, I can make notes and um, just flick around without having to have too much hassle of just changing over on the screen. So, yeah, this is what I managed to get done last night. So, here you've got Rock talking to Croven, and you know, I'm not going to give too much away with the thing because you know, I want you guys to read it and I want you to enjoy it. So, and that'll be up in a few weeks, uh, this page. So, got a little bit of a buffer, so we're about two or three pages ahead of ourselves, which is pretty cool. <laughs> So, uh, they're the layouts that I managed to do last night, so hopefully I'll get another couple of pages done tonight, and that'll be pretty cool, because I really want to get ahead of myself as much as I can. If I can get at least three or four pages, even five or six pages ahead of uploading schedules, then at least I can sort of rest comfortably if I'm laying, like, kind of struggling or behind one week, I don't have to stress out as much, and I don't have to freak out, and I think that'll be better for the book as well, because I can focus more on it. So, yeah, well, sorry. Open a GI. There we go. Okay. So another thing I wanted to talk about was uh, I've mentioned in the last couple of uh, blogs about a game that I'm working on. I thought I'd probably should talk about it a little bit because it's coming up soon. I've done a lot of work for it for the past year at least. Uh, we actually started it would have been the beginning of last year, so the beginning of 20. What did you rank? 30. Uh, yeah, 2013. So we did a lot of planning then. This is the we finally started fleshing it out, doing the artwork, and really nutting out the game. We did some test games a few months back, and now we're just doing our first uh, um, test run. So we just got some cards printed. Uh, there's still a lot of artwork to do, but at least we get an idea of what the card designs look like, and if there's going to be any changes. And we can also play it with a few people, so we'll be doing that too, and as that happens, we'll let you know on how the game goes. Uh, but the game's called Kill the Hero, and essentially we're planning on kickstarting this in uh, the very, very near future, so I kind of hope it'll only be about a couple of months away, as long as I can get the artwork done. But in saying that, I need to be able to have the time off work. Uh, I can't take the time off work if I can't afford it, so I'm trying to think of ways that I can do that. Uh, one of those is uh, inspired by Kevin, uh, is doing the Teespring. So I'm just trying to think of ideas I can do to um, do some t-shirt designs um, and sell those. Uh, but obviously I want them to be t-shirt designs that people like. And I want to steer clear of the fan art as well. So I 
I'm going to work on that and see what I can do. So that's something I'll be working on soon. And if you've ever got any ideas too, let me know. I'd love to hear it. Because, uh, yeah, for the moment, for original work, apart from The Legend of Rock and Kill the Hero, um, I'm pretty sort of flat as far as ideas go. So maybe I'll do something on those, I don't know. Uh, that could be could be an idea. So we'll see what we go, I'll keep you updated on that. Uh, otherwise, sorry, I'm just checking my list here. Uh, just want a quick plug for Legend of Rock. If you haven't checked it out, go to thelegendofrock.com. Uh, the webcomic's there, all the info's there. I've also set up a donation page, so if you like the book, uh, if you think it's worth a couple of bucks, you know, every time, uh, we'd love to, uh, love to get a donation from you, because every little bit goes to helping towards us make the book and also publish the book, so by the time we finish the issue, we can get some physical copies out as well. Um, and last, I just want to say thank you everyone for watching, uh, liking and commenting on the video so far, your support's been awesome. Yeah, so I, pre I appreciate everything that everyone um, liked and said so far about the videos, and I think I'm pretty confident I'll be doing this for 100 days. Uh, look forward to it. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.